you guys. A lot of us are going through different things. Uh, so much like anxiousness in me right now. But it's not just like all sunshine and rainbows, you know? Good morning, guys. Hello. Welcome back to my channel. Another video for your quarantine. If you're new, my name is Danielle. Hey, what's up? Subscribe down below. I've been posting videos all the time. So it's Friday morning and I have class at 1010 on Zoom, Zoom University, if you will. Um, it's 930 right now and I just woke up in a funk. I've been, you know, I feel like all of this comes in waves and this morning I woke up and I was just like, bleh, you know, I'm sure a lot of you guys are feeling this way. I'm not trying to complain. I'm just trying to talk to you guys about how I'm feeling because I know it can relate to a lot of you guys and I want to, you know, spread positivity, but I also want to be real with you guys. And right now I'm just not feeling very positive and I hate it. I hate it so much. <laughs> um, so I thought I'd make this video because one, when I film videos, I'm in a better mood. And two, I feel like this can really help you guys. So I'm going to kind of take you through my day on how to boost your mood during quarantine, how to kind of get out of a funk because I know that this is really mentally exhausting and a lot of us are going through different things. Um, and I think, what is that? Oh, good, we have a pimple. I just want to show you guys kind of some things I'm going to do to boost my mood in any sort of way I can. <sighs> I hate feeling like this. I, like, constantly feel like I just have a pit in my stomach. But my friend said this the other day, Katie. She was like, you're not stuck at home, you're safe at home. And it really just, like, hit me. It's so true, like, we should be so thankful that we are at home we're safe at home we're okay we're healthy we have a roof over our head and that is something that i'm just trying to remember um you know i just miss my friends i miss having my routine everyone does like we're all just kind of trying to figure it all out here but so i just woke up pjs of the day i toured columbia university like my junior year of high school and i fell in love with it i was like i'm going <laughs> okay anyways first thing i have to do is open up the blinds Okay, it's pretty nice weather outside, thankfully. It's sunny. Um, that's like the first thing I do when I'm trying to get out of bed because it inspires me. I'm like, wow, the world is up. Like, I should be too. And what is up with the pimple? Also, I need to make my bed because otherwise I'm 100% just gonna hop back into it. And yes, I've been sleeping with this. You know, it's a good cuddle buddy during this lonely time. <laughs> Also, just got these new twinkly lights that have a remote. Amazon, highly suggest. I'm gonna make them a little brighter. There we go. What else do I wanna do? Oh, I wanna turn that on. I wanna light a candle. Also, this is a little messy, I need to fix that. It's like a clean linen scent. Still not in the best mood, but like, we're on our way. Decided to get after it this morning and have a bagel sandwich. It just, they really boost my mood. She's a sesame bagel with ham and a uh, fried egg on top, but they're so filling that I am not ready for the second half. But you know, good food makes you happy. So I decided I'm gonna do my online class out here. So today's my friend Tori D. Simone's birthday and she's a spin instructor and I guess she's doing a live class for her birthday. <laughs> in there with her because i am just i've been in my room constantly i'm doing youtube in there i'm doing schoolwork in there it's just like i'm constantly in there and no one's really out here right now my mom's over there but yeah all right it's zoom time <laughs> class is done i changed my background my phone to this it's one of our gals on the go wallpapers and you know, that's where we are right now. It's all about self-love and doing things for yourself, which is so important. So I just wanted that to be a reminder right now. As you guys saw during my class, my mom wrote me a little sticky note and asked to go on a bike ride. And I, once again, just like, I need to be active every day because I have so much like anxiousness in me right now. And I think by going for a bike ride, it'll really help. So I'm glad she came up with that idea. I need a little hype up song. This song always gets me hype. Oh, 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 
bright colors are just happy i swear so i'm wearing this set from outdoor voices i don't know the name of it i really don't know the name of any of this but if i can find a link i'll link it down below for you guys bright pink very happy and then i'm wearing these adidas sneakers i think these are the oh i don't know like the raptors or something i don't really know Woo. got my water very important Wow, very bright. Right as I was about to go for this bike ride, I was told we're having a family meeting outside. More than six feet apart. Uh, we're going over how to put on a mask. Obviously we don't need it out here. Danielle's filming this. Danielle! What? <laughs> She's starting to lose it, folks. As you can see, that is a flamingo in her net. Hey guys. So I haven't been on my bike ride yet. Um, right before we left, my family decided to call a family meeting. And the last time we had a family meeting, our parents told us they were getting separated. So I knew it wasn't gonna be fun. It freaks me out. I know my parents are older and I don't want to get them sick. I don't want to get sick. I know it affects young people too. It's just like... <sighs> this is really hard. And I feel selfish for like going insane because I'm so thankful. But it's so hard mentally and I'm trying not to balance it all. So I'm gonna... Sit here and cry for a little bit. I do every day. It's important to let your emotions out. I have no shame. Because it's fun to cry. And then I'll go on my bike ride. Hello. So it's a little bit later. Um, I just went outside and just kind of felt my emotions. I called Ryan. Well, this is hard for all of us for different reasons. And living in your house with your family can be tough sometimes and everyone has different emotions at different times. And I think that's kind of what was happening today is I was trying to like boost my mood and I was about to like go for a bike ride because I need to let energy out. And then we like talked about everything and I just got more anxious about everything. But it's important to feel your emotions and that's okay. And honestly, that song, What Doesn't Kill You Makes You Stronger. It's so true. Like once all of this calms down, we're all gonna like seriously live our lives to the most and I'm going to appreciate everything and everyone in my life so 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 much more they say there can't be sunshine without rain and that's so true like you have to see you have to have the negativity to like appreciate the positivity god i need some breathe essential oil this stuff gets me through it it's just a breathing blend i know i'm like this video is like how to boost your mood but it's not just like all sunshine and rainbows you know all right so now it's 140. <laughs> Thought my bike ride was gonna be over by now, but that's okay. I'm gonna go grab my mom and I think we're gonna go for a bike ride now. And Drake just came out with a new song, Toozy Sly. I don't even know how to say it, and it's pretty good, so go listen. Here we are, I've got my speaker going. It feels great out. I already feel better just like getting after it. Oh my god. I was pretending like I was in the spin bag. I was like, down cross press. <laughs> bike ride feeling like a toddler but this lunch makes me happy we got pb and j and triscuits because we don't have any chips and salsa right now it's totally midday right now but um i want to watch an episode of the morning show Woo! hey guys so the bike ride was absolutely amazing it just felt so good to get outside and like just be with my mom and i brought my speaker and i played music i made a new playlist on my soundcloud it, i think it's just danielle carolyn and the playlist is called quarantine and chill and it's like a ton of like fun edm just like happy remixes if you guys want to check it out um and yeah and then we watched an episode of the morning show in the living room it was really good i had my classic lunch a good old pb and j i'll never grow up i swear in that sense and then i fell asleep on the couch and then i came in here and i slept a little longer it's now 5 20 and yeah, I'm in a way better headspace than I was this morning, and that just happens. Um, and I think it's just all about feeling your emotions and letting them come out. And then, you know, acting on them and, you know, going for a bike ride or going outside or talking to someone about it or calling someone. 
I think the worst thing you can do is just like keep it in. However, there are times when sometimes I just want to be in my room alone. So it's definitely just important to kind of like be in touch with how you're feeling. Um, I closed my blinds because I just wanted a nap. Let's see if my mom will go throw the football with me. I, I don't know why you guys, I've been obsessed with throwing the football. It just like puts me in a really good mood. Hey. What's up? <laughs> you wanna go play some football? Yeah. That's <laughs> yeah, do, that's all we do every day. <laughs> it's always us girlies. To find the football, it's somewhere out back, I'm sure. I can't stress the importance of being outside if you can. Whether it's just sitting out on your back porch, getting some vitamin D, it is so good for you. Grabbing this guy. I found the football. Drake's new song. Guys, this is live footage of me teaching my mom Savage the TikTok dance. I start off, I go, so it starts off, I'm a savage. And what did you say? I am a savage. I am a savage. <laughs> savage. Freestyle, 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 I'm a savage. Okay. Savage. And then there's like a little beat. It goes, I'm a savage, clap. And you kind of clap in their face. So you're down on savage. Not down, but you're just kind of like, uh. Savage. Yeah, cool. But you pop it, so you come back. Savage. Yeah, a little faster. I'm a savage. And then you go to the right and to the left. Classy, bougie. Classy and bougie. Cheers. <laughs> okay, guys. So, officially taught my mom savage. We haven't recorded it yet because she's not ready. But it's almost 7 o'clock. And Pure Velo, the spin studio that I work for and teach at and I love, we're doing a Zoom happy hour tonight and I'm so excited. I miss all of them so much. So, everyone's getting their drink. I'm grabbing mine. Um, this is my second time buying this wine. I really like it. It's the Chloe Pinot Grigio. It was like $11, but I just, the bottle. It's really pretty. And Chego vibe. Got the wine. Oh, baby. Hello! Cool backyard. That's awesome. Listen to them with sound. Okay, wow. That was just like the absolute highlight of my day. I just got off Zoom with like a ton of people from Pure Velo. We had a big old Pure Velo happy hour. People came and went at different times. I stayed on the whole time for an hour and a half. Um, well, there's there's like a couple people still on, but I really need a shower. Like, I actually smell myself. Oh, wow. It is just crazy. Like, sometimes I feel like people are like, oh, yeah, let's Zoom, and then no one ever actually does it, or let's FaceTime tonight, and no one actually ever falls through with it, you know? And I'm so glad that we all did, because it was seriously so much fun to just talk to other people and, like, see how they're handling all of this, and I think it's so important for all of us to do, because it was just so, I don't know, comforting, and we were just, like, saying funny stories and, like, just laughing about stuff that's just happening, and... It was just so nice, so I really urge you to, even when you don't think you're in a social mood, just get on the Zoom, get on the FaceTime, call someone, because it is crazy how much it can change your mood. So with that, um, I'm gonna take a shower. I'm not washing my hair because I wanna work out in the morning and there's just no point. And my hair still like isn't greasy. I'm like really happy with it. This Dyson Air app, you guys, this is like a blowout. I'm obsessed. Feeling a lot more fresh after I showered and I just washed my face. Well, I, I used the cold press peel pads again and I just feel so good. Um, and now I'm going to get on Zoom call number two of the night. Tonight was supposed to be my sorority's formal. It was going to be at the Georgia Theater and we had the rooftop rented too. It was going to be so dope. Obviously, we're not there right now and it's bummy. Like last year, I had the time of my life with all my friends and Ryan was my date and that's when we first started dating. It was just so fun and like, it's crazy, but I'm so thankful that next year we get to do it at least. So that's good. But anyways, we're about to do a zoom call in honor of formal and um, a few of my friends are <laughs> wearing their dresses and uh, my dress is in athens and i'm just so comfy in my t-shirts i'm not gonna do that and i already had enough wine for the night so i switched to chamomile tea they're just gonna call me lame overall but that's okay um but i'm really excited i just shut my door my mom's watching a really loud movie Ooh. but it's it's just so crazy how like from this morning when i woke up i really didn't even know if i could get in a better mood and then the family meeting and just everything like I was in a really crappy mood, and now I'm just feeling so much better. I show your dresses. Formal. Woo! Yes, queens. Love it. Kenna, hi. At Georgia Theater.
<laughs> I'm so sleepy, but tonight was so much fun. It's literally only like 10 20, but today has just been an emotionally exhausting day, but also really, really good. But I'm going to get in bed. I don't even like have the energy to like even go on my phone. Like, I'm literally just gonna go to bed, which is not something that's normal. So, I love you guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you soon. Subscribe. Bye.